Your fat head just arrived and you couldn't be happier. And now it's time to put it up. But how? First, select a spot. Fathead wall graphics adhere well to smooth indoor surfaces in a temperature-controlled environment, such as smooth walls, glass, metal, sanded wood without lacquer, and yes, plain old painted drywall, as long as the paint was applied at least 30 days prior to hanging your fathead. You may be thinking, wow, it sounds like I can hang a fathead just about anywhere. Well, don't think that. That's a dumb thing to think. Here is a list of surfaces on which we do not recommend you hang a fathead. Textured walls, unpainted drywall, brick, cinder block, porous textured paneling, anywhere outdoors, and freshly painted walls. And now make sure you have room for your fathead. The dimensions of your fathead can be found on fathead.com. Measure the space to make sure the fathead will fit. Next, use a warm, damp cloth to wipe down the wall. Do not use soap or cleaning agents and let the wall dry completely. If you're in the privacy of your own home, you needn't worry if your underpants show while you clean your wall. Next, find yourself a friend to help you hang the fathead. Greeting your friend with a high five or high ten is a good way to show him or her that you appreciate the help that he or she is about to provide. And now remove the fathead from its box. Once removed, unroll your fathead and let it relax, lying flat on the floor for approximately an hour. And we're back. With the help of your friend, start at the top of your fathead and slowly peel it away from its backing. Be careful to not let the fathead stick to itself as that can be a stone cold bummer. Place one corner of the fathead on the wall and slowly smooth the rest into place using minimal pressure. If you make a mistake, there is no need for a tantrum, an outburst, or a hissy fit. Instead, simply peel the fathead off the wall and reposition it until you are satisfied. Using the yellow plastic squeegee that came with your fathead, remove wrinkles and air bubbles by starting at the middle of your fathead and pushing out to the edges. Most real big fatheads come with extra decals. These can be applied to the wall just like the larger fathead. And now your fathead is up. This is probably the greatest moment of your life, so be sure to savor it as you think about which fathead you would like to purchase next. This concludes the fathead installation video. For real. See what I did there? I got in the tagline there. I just I thought of that as I was going. Pretty good.